Hi, this is Mati Hipsch, the Guru Guru, and today I'd like to uh, share with you this update on the only three ways to be found on the search engine result page of a Google search. Um, there are a couple other ways with videos and news feeds, but they're not relevant to most businesses. So what you see here is I have gone into google.co.uk and I've put in a search for Floris Kensington and here is your standard search results page from Google. And what you see here is uh, two listings that are on a light pinkish background called sponsored links and then you also see sponsored links down the right hand side. This is Google's AdWords program. It's driven through an auction system where people compete for different key phrases. We can see on top of Blooming Delight, we can see over here, um, you know, Marks and Spence, brand names that we expect to see, Interfloral, all of these organizations are bidding on these keywords to show up on the front page of Google in this top area. Just below these search results, what we see here is the data that comes from Google's Places. This used to be called Google's Local Business Center, it's now Google Places, and I'm going to be talking a fair bit about this. And then just below that, we see the organic or the natural search engine optimized results. So let's take these one at a time. If you do a Google search for Google AdWords, you'll see their online advertising program, and you can link through to their uh, service and create your own account, or you can call for help. This is linked through to one of my AdWords accounts, and it's giving me a US number. When you do it, it'll give you a UK number. So um, that's how you can set up and create your own AdWords account. Um, it's worth noting, uh, here's an eye tracking study that was done on a Google search results page and it shows you the intensity of your eye as it moves, not surprisingly, from the upper left uh, across and down. The X's are where people have clicked and these red lines are where different screen resolutions cut off. Interesting to note that uh, this is the hot spot, this is where your eye is and this is where the clicks are. So if we go back to our search results, for, we can see that the, the eye tracking is in this area. Now, Google Places, which used to be Google Low School Business Center, is 100% free. If you go to Google Places and do a search for Google Places in Google, again, you'll find their Google Places, uh, and you can click on that, and it will take you through where you're able to create your own uh, listing or claim your listing. Google Places is 100% free, and the reason it's important is while it shows up here in a regular organic search of Google or a standard Google search, it also powers the information that's in Google Maps, it powers the information in Google Earth, and it powers the information in Google Mobile. All of these are important. Here you can see there's an owner verified listing, so the owner of this a hospital florist has come in here and put in information and you can see they're allowed to put in pictures, they can get reviews, they have street view, they've got maps. All of this is available to all of you using Google Places, so check it out. Uh, the last area we see um, in the Google Organic or the Google Universal Search or Organic Search is this these SEO results down here. Now let's be honest here. A lot of people say about getting you found here and how it's easy and how it's free, but there are over 200,000 results for this first page, and um, that's a lot of competition to get here. And it's important to realize that 80% of the people spend most of their time here, what's called above the fold, and they don't scroll down to these listings that are below the fold. 80% stay up here and click somewhere up here. So uh, if you want to find out the best ways to optimize your site for these positions, just do a Google search on the SEO starter guide and you'll find that Google has created a document that's available in um, 40 different languages, the search engine optimization starter guide. Um, and like I said, it's in 40 different languages, 22 pages, it's 100% free, and it'll tell you most of everything you need to know about 99% about search engine optimization. So that's how you get yourself found on the front page of Google. You do it here with paid listings, uh, you do it here in Google Places, or you do it here through search engine optimization. Hope you found that helpful, and if you'd like some help on any of these three areas, you can just fill out the form on the right, and one of our friendly team will give you a call and uh, assist you in that, because you might be better spent spending your time working on your business than trying to figure out Google. Again, thank you. This is Monty Hitch, the Google Guru, and thank you for your time.